Alright Jason, we're here at uh, one of our listings and we're getting it ready for, to go on the market and I figured now would be a good time to maybe tell people who you are. Um, quickly, where were you born, where were you raised? I was actually born in uh, Central Florida, uh, out right outside of Orlando. Um, I was raised here in Central Florida. Um, so I, specifically in like Longwood, like Mary? Uh, I, was, I was born and raised uh, in Central Florida, but I, I, I grew up in Longwood. Where did you, what about the school system? What schools did you go to? Uh, I went to Woodlands Elementary, then I went on to Rock Lake Middle School, uh, and then I graduated from Lake Mary High School in 2008. So you're literally a, a product of the Seminole County School System? I am a product of the Seminole County School System. So then what was the next step for you after uh, graduating high school? Uh, I then went on to Florida Gulf Coast University on a baseball scholarship. Um, after a short stint at Florida Gulf Coast, I took my uh, studies to St. Petersburg College, uh, where I also pursued baseball. Um, and I was there in, until 2010, and then I was drafted in the Major League Baseball First Year Players Draft. All right, sweet. So what, uh, what was your fields of study in college? What was your focus? Uh, I, I focused on business management and sports management. Okay, so you have some business acumen there. Right, right, exactly. All right, so tell us a little bit about baseball. Um, Who did you play for and what level of ball did you play? I actually, I played for the, uh, the Atlanta Braves. Um, I, I made it through uh, A ball and, and then I went on to play uh, spring training uh, with the major leaguers and then I actually got injured. Uh, so that brought me to what do I do now? Um, as, as most of you know, if you're an athlete, um, injuries are, are occurring and, and it takes you to places you never thought you'd be. It's also called growing old. It happens. <laughs> yep, <right? laughs> yep, yep. Growing old is definitely part of it. And you played for the Braves, right? Yes, sir, I did. I played for the Atlanta Braves. I played center field. Um, I was known to be a five tool athlete. As a, so you call it, if you know baseball, that's a, that's a, a good a, a accomplishment. Um, so you had so, a lot of different skill sets in baseball? Yeah, you could say I had a lot of different, different skill sets. I what, could do it all. How do you think that translates now in the business? Uh, definitely dedication, um, perseverance, uh, they're, they're, they're all, um, uh, as a culmination, um, it, it makes up who I am. Uh, when, you, when you do something for 20 years, uh, it, it tends to start to take a, a mold as to, uh, on who you are. So you'd say that uh, baseball taught you dedication and hard work and, and the things now that, right. that are helping you in business? Oh, of course, yeah, it, it, it all plays a part. All right, so, so like most of us, uh, where age maybe starts to catch up, up to us a little bit, um, you started now in the professional world. What was your next step after baseball? I actually went on to uh, a sales coordinator um, and, and head of sales for AccuCrete Incorporated. Um, it's, as, as if you know me personally, um, it is a family business. Um, it's a residential and commercial concrete company. Uh, we focus on residential driveways, you know, basketball courts, uh, sidewalks, um, all the way up to the, the, the big heavy duty commercial stuff, uh, you know, ice rinks and, and you know, uh, foundation lays for, for some of the, you know, the skyscrapers, if you will, uh, that we have here in, in downtown Orlando. That's actually a pretty big company, is it not? Yeah, yeah, it actually is a really big company. Uh, it was founded in 2000 uh, by my grandfather and my father. Um, and, and they worked it for 10 years, uh, and then they, you know, unfortunately split, but, uh, but it's still a, a part of my life and my family. Uh, so, yeah, it was, it, it's been a good experience for me. Now, why real estate? Was there anything that led you towards uh, this direction? Uh, did you have any background in real estate? Well, I, I didn't uh, until I actually partnered with my, my, my family. Uh, I saw that they were flipping homes. Um, making a pretty good living doing it on the side uh, and I decided that was something I wanted to be a part of so uh, I, I asked them if, if I could start to help out around you know the houses and, and get a get a feel for what it takes uh, contracting and doing uh, you know handyman you know jobs myself um, and uh, after I acquired a little capital myself I, I decided to invest with them um, and and we've done quite a few successful houses uh, here here in the Orlando area um, and, and I just, I, I got infatuated with, with the real estate industry and I decided that that was something that I wanted to pursue. Um, so I went ahead and, and I got my real estate license um, and, and now I'm here at Alton Clark. 
So uh, you literally got to handle every facet uh, when you guys were investing, right? I mean, did you handle contracts? I handled any, anything from contracts to, to finding contractors, um, to, to finding properties. Um, you, you know, on, I was on the horn all the time talking to, you know, whoever it was, um, scheduling, um, being, in part, being, being in charge of funding um, and, and budgets, you know, you name it, uh, I handled it. So you have a pretty good eye. I think that would probably be pretty useful to a buyer to, to have somebody that knows how to pick a house apart, right? Yeah, yeah. I mean, when I walk into a house, um, everything aside, it's a blank canvas to me. Um, but I also can see things for what they are. Uh, I can, I, I'm, I'm really great at, at pointing out um, anything that doesn't belong or does or anything that's an asset or not. Um, so yeah, I, when I walk into a house, um, I get sort of a, a brain warp, if you will, um, and I go into a, a, another mode, um, and, and that's something that I, I feel is a gift. So hopefully your buyer shouldn't be buying money pits then, right? You, <laughs> you'll see those things coming. I don't, I don't buy losers, so uh, yeah, I, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a winner uh, when it comes to buying homes, yeah. All right, very good. If, if, last thing, if anybody watching this uh, was thinking about hiring uh, somebody to represent them, to either buy or sell, what would be the one thing, if they only gave you one thing, what would be the one thing that is your single greatest trait as to why somebody should choose Jason Mowry? I'm relentless. I won't stop. I'll work for you until you won't work for yourself. I'll, 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 until you tell me to stop, I still might not even stop. Uh, I'm, I'm going to keep going and going and pushing forward. Um, and, and I'm going to get the job done the right way. Um, and, and, and it's not going to take long. So. That's, that's kind of who I am and that's, that's what I'm all about and that's, that's why I'm here. And, uh, and, and I, I look at myself as, as somebody that's, that's gonna get it done for you, so. All right, very good, Jason. Thanks for your time. Yep, thank you.